A two-hour drive from Haikou Milan Airport in South China's Hainan Province is the only coastal space launch center in the country. Posters advertising real estate projects line the road on the way to the Wenchang Space Launch Center. The small city, once famous only for its chicken, now also have rockets and satellites associated with its name. When I reached the launch center, a rocket was waiting. I'm now standing about one kilometer away from the launch pads. As you can see, there are two launch pads. On my right is the one for the Long March 7 carrier rocket, which is currently carrying China's first cargo spacecraft, Tianzhou-1. And on my left is the one exclusively for China's heavy lift Long March 5 carrier rocket. I was here last year to witness its maiden launch. And I can tell you, it's the most amazing thing I've ever seen. The Wenchang Space Launch Center, or WSLC, was constructed from 2009 to 2014. In 2016, China's latest rockets, Long March 7 and Long March 5, both made their maiden flights from here. The Wenchang Space Launch Center provides space vehicles the advantage of using the Earth's greater rotational speed at lower latitudes. This lowers fuel requirements for the rocket to reach orbit. Because the area sits by the sea, it's also convenient to transport gigantic rockets like the Long March 5 carrier vehicles. In fact, spacecraft and rockets are manufactured in different places in China, so they have to be transported in parts to this launch site and assembled vertically in this giant building that looks exactly like capital letter C lying on the ground. The taller arm of this building is the 501 assembly factory with the height of 101 meters. And this huge iron gate is 81 meters tall. It's the highest in Asia, perhaps even in the world. Assembly Factory 501 was built for putting together China's first and largest heavy lift carrier rocket, the Long March 5, while its neighbor 502 is for the Long March 7. The modules of China's future space lab will be mounted here onto the rocket. This is the commanding center of the launch site, and at the launch night, all the orders will be given from here. Now let's take inside look. Senior engineer Zhu Liangping, who participated in the site's construction, walked me around the campus. He said transparency and internationalization were in the genes of the WSLC from the start. It's definitely more open than other launch sites in China. First, it is surrounded by an open terrain. Second, from the very beginning of its construction, we decided that it should be an open and cutting-edge facility. Finally, Hainan is a tourist destination. So boosting tourism was also a consideration. This new launch facility is crucial in China's future space programs, not only because of the new spacecraft and rockets, but also the changes in Chinese space culture that this new facility represents. Gu Yifei, CGTN, Wenchang Space Launch Center.